All right, so I just wanted to do a quick review on the new Escapist Umbrella, which you can only get in the Impossible Escape LTM in the PvP version. So you can see in the top right, it says win an umbrella. And this is the harder one. This one to the left here says PvE. And in the top right, it says win a loading screen. So you have to make sure that you're on the PvP one, okay? I had tons of comments saying, hey, I won the match and I only got a loading screen. That's because you were on the wrong one. Go to the harder one, which is against actual people. This one, you're all on the same team. The PvP, you're actually against other squads. And there's only one chopper in this mode. Now, if you need help on what to do, I will link it in the outro. I did a full video review showing exactly what you have to do, step by step. So check that out. Now, this game mode is available until May 25th. So you have about seven days to do this, which is plenty of time. Now, the matches are long. They do take about 30 minutes to 40 minutes a piece. So good luck. So here's what the umbrella looks like. Again, it's called the Escapist, and it goes under your Victory Royale umbrellas because that's exactly what it is. So the design on the top is actually pretty cool. It totally reminds me of caveman drawings. You've got the guys running from the raptors. You've got the helicopter there. You've got the guy holding up the piece of raptor claw after he eliminates them. It's pretty awesome. Just a hand-drawn Victory Royale umbrella. It's got that nice gray or cream color scheme on it plus the red caveman drawings as well. But the interesting part about this is the noise that it makes. So when I hop into a match, I don't even know how to describe it, but I will play it for you as loud as I can, and it just boggles my mind. So it says you've earned this flight. Now, of course, it's not the most flashy umbrella we've ever had. It's not really animated with anything. And in actuality, it's pretty plain, but boy, oh boy, is it hard to get. It's just like this one-shot umbrella from Season 9 where you had to win the John Wick mode. So let's go ahead and equip it, and I'll show you this bizarre sound that it makes in an actual match. So here we go. Let me go to Battle Lab. All right, so here we go. I'm going to be completely quiet, and I'm going to turn the sound all the way up. Listen very carefully. Here you go. So I don't know if you can hear that, but listen when I press forward. It's kind of like a rustling noise. And when you don't move, it reminds me of white noise. Like someone's muffled microphone on a random squads match. So listen when I undeploy it. That noise goes away. Here it comes again. Listen. It's almost like a static white noise. Like I said, this is totally the noise I recognize when someone has a crappy mic in a duos or squads match. At first I thought it was my system acting up, but then when you don't deploy it, it goes away. It's like a rustling or a hissing white noise effect. But why? What is that from? I don't remember that in the game mode. I just remember the chopper noise and the scary music at nighttime when the, all the animals came out and the zombies appeared. But what is this white noise? I don't understand the significance here. Let me do it again. Like I said, when I first did it, I thought it was my PS4 making noise. Can anyone explain to me what this noise is? So here it is one more time. Just a creepy, creepy noise. But you can see the majestic cave-like paintings on the top. It tells a whole story right there on how I acquired this incredible umbrella. You can kind of see it underneath as well. So the real question is, is it worth playing the impossible escape game mode to win this? I would say yes. Just because I don't know that this will ever come back out. We thought the same for the John Wick LTM, but then it eventually came back out. But this one, I don't know. Is this just a limited time game mode? If so, this is gonna be super, super rare, super exclusive. So you'll wanna make sure that you have this in your inventory, in your locker, to show off to people that don't have it. But again, it could come back one day and then people will have that opportunity again, but I wouldn't wanna risk it. It's a nice looking umbrella. Like I said, it's not the flashiest. It doesn't make the best noise but at least it'll be somewhat rare 
and somewhat exclusive. So there you go. That's all there is to it. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. A like is always appreciated. And don't forget to use my supporter creator code, which is TaperTime.